Welcome to the uh, Plex Remote demonstration. And now we have the Plex uh, opened, and uh, now we have to uh, open my uh, Plex Remote controller. Now it's loading. Now first, we have to uh, configure the uh, Plex server IP, so we can click for configure. Now we have some IP and port. We just need to import the correct uh, port. Now it's ready. Port, and then we have done. Now it's correct uh, setting up, so we can control our Plex with our Plex remote. Now it's uh, need to OK. Now we enter the Plex menu. We can use the uh, left, right, up, down control to control the menu. To scroll up one menu, and down. So uh, we want to enter the watch movies. So uh, OK. Now we enter the movie center. Now we have a, uh, a few uh, movie titles there. We can move around uh, the menu. And we can play it with OK. Now uh, we are going to loading up the uh, files so uh, it's a file loading a dialog we need to plex to load it up because it's quite a bit now let's cache it now okay it's loaded now we are entering the movie playing mode but we still use the uh, plex remote all the same so we can pause it by okay once now it's paused now i can click okay to proceed now to resume. Now we can click the menu item to bring up the video OSD menu, which is controls the details of the uh, video play. We click once. Now it's going on. We can stop it to fast rewind, back rewind, and control the audio settings. We still use the move left, right. Now move right once. Right. We can bring up the uh, audio settings and the subtitle, subtitle settings. OK. Oh, now the audio settings and the subtitle settings, is, we can still use the left, right, and up and down to control it. Now if we want to return, to, to click the uh, return menu. OK, it's return. Return button again to escape from the uh, OSD menu and resume it. Let's play it. Now we can also use the uh, left right to skip up a little bit because we just click one right place so to skip a little bit and back it's back here. If we click it up it will skip forward a big step. Now you can see under the taskbar we again we move forward a little bit with backward. We're also backward. Now we have to use the uh, volume control to increase the volume. You may attention to the uh, left corner, up corner. We we'll bring down the volume. Now, so if we want to stop it or the return from it, we just click the return button now it's a stop audio playing so we use the uh, same control to control the video play and uh, manual scrolling now we have to demonstration about the uh, uh, context menu sometimes, okay And we bring up the uh, on-screen keyboard to demonstrate our on-screen keyboard control. Now we enter the Plex input interface, which uses the on-screen keyboard. However, we cannot use the uh, normal left, right, up, down, because it's the on-screen keyboard. So we click the on-screen keyboard switch button. Now it's the status, uh, is so we use the still left, left. Now the focus 
is moving. So we uh, input uh, a uh, M. Okay. Now we enter a new M. Now we move back. Done. Okay, now its name is REM with a new title. So we switch off the OSK and use the uh, menu. So it's quite easy and intuitive. All use the uh, same interface. Just in the uh, on screen keyboard, we have to switch to the OSK control, but still use the same control. Now we return to up level menu. Yes, and that's the uh, demonstration of the uh, Plex remote. Quite easy, and have fun.